to more people having this disease or that disease. Inflammation is a big tie to that. So it always goes back down to what can you do to take things away, to detox the body. Detox the body, cleanse the body from things that will cause inflammation. Very, very important thing to remember. Always decrease the sugar, always increase your good fats, your omega 3s. Omega 3 is a very big player. Omega 3 comes in the form of flax seed. Yes, yes, everyone talks about the fishes. I don't push the fish oils, but then I don't stop them being used either because I don't think it's a, it's a major, it causes a major dent negatively. If anything, if you're not taking the natural forms of omega 3, your your, um, your fish oil, your omega 3s, in the form of capsules, are actually a positive thing to take. But then I prefer to be taking it in its natural form. As much as possible, I would always push the natural form of things. Because I always say that if you are focusing on one, what we refer to as a phytochemical, chemicals or nutrients in the plant world, that particular chemical that was taken out of its natural habitat and put in a pill had other things playing with it in its habitat. It's kind of like taking that sexy saxophonist out of the whole band because he's fantastic. And making him play that same tune. It doesn't quite seem to sound the same. Even Ken G won't sound the same without his surrounding players. Very, very important facts. I always say, if you can, leave it in its natural form and take it there. But if you can't, or if you're not taking, you know you're not eating healthy, you know you're not, unfortunately not going to eat healthy, then yes, omega 3 is coming to it. So your good fats, I refer to omega 3. Decreasing glucose, and of course, with that, you'll reduce inflammation. Reducing inflammation increases the um, propensity for these form for these um, problems with the thyroid to continue to go forward. Very, very important fact. And of course, when you're utilizing um, iodine, just remember that again, what has iodine in it? We've gone over that already, and re remember that sometimes you have to take iodine supplements. But again, I always go back to what's a natural form? Well, how can I find this naturally? And again, it goes back to your sea vegetables. 